Dandy, ready to give the old Powie Zowie unlocking another try? Yes, I was disappointed that your last attempt did not unlock my Powie Zowie. Me too. You're a tough kid to please. I have exacting standards. So, you got any ideas for other things to try? Yes, one of the things I'm trying to collect are microchips from Boxmore Robots. But they are obviously quite hard to come by. Why would you want those evil things? Technology is neither good nor evil, K.O. Those classifications only apply to what we use technology to achieve. In fact, it could be argued that good and evil are murky concepts with no universal definition. Nuh-uh! Boxmore is definitely evil! Okay, well, how would I get my hands on Boxmore microchips anyway? The Boxmore bots were programmed to have hubristic qualities. Hubri what? They taunt and act like jerks, but there is a bug in the program. During a battle, if a Boxmore robot enters its taunting state, they are left vulnerable for a brief moment. If you hit them while they are taunting, it will initiate a behavioral override. The robots will malfunction. And then you can literally beat the microchips out of them. Whoa! And what do you do with them? Educational enrichment. Find a jerky box more bot and see if you can exploit this bug and get me their microchips. Howdy, howdy, go! You can do this, KO!
feel weird giving these to you, but here goes. Thanks, K.O. I promise I am not using them for evil. Not enough. Oh man. Let's try unlocking it again tomorrow. Oh, by the way, you can always bring me box more microchips you collect in battle. And in return, I'll give you technos. Holy moly! Using evil robot microchips for good! As in, hopefully I can spend these technos and get some good POW cards. Yeah. Kung football after work again today? Huh? Oh, uh, no, I'm... I'm doing a show in Neo Riot City tonight. Also, this is my last day of work. What? I've got a hit song on the charts, so I don't need to be stuck behind this counter anymore. But you're still gonna be around the plaza, right? Nah, my management team says I need to reboot my image. I'm moving to Neo Riot City into something called a... loft? So... I guess this is goodbye. So, like, goodbye. No! It can't be! Enid? Look, K.O., don't make this all weird for me, okay? I've changed. One day you'll get older and realize that there's more to the world than just Lakewood Plaza Turbo. No! I won't! And this isn't you! You aren't just DJ Fireball to me! You're my buddy, Enid! Alright, K.O., here's my last rules of cool test. What's the cool thing to do when you score a hit song and everybody in the world thinks you're awesome? Answer, quit your lame day job. I'm glad your music dreams came true, Enid. But if the only way to follow your dreams means turning your back on your friends, well, that sounds like a bad dream to me. Goodbye, DJ Fireball. I need to talk to you about Enid. Don't you mean DJ Fireball? Why is she being like this? She's doing exactly what I would do if I suddenly became a hit recording artist. Acting ice cold and blowing this popsicle stand. But dang, it hurts to be on the receiving end of so much coolitude. Think, Rad. She's leaving for Neo Riot City unless we do something. The aunt we know would totally find it lame to blow off her friends. Don't know, dude. It would take some serious heat to melt through that amount of cool. Brad, you're a genius. I know, but why? Remember that day the three of us had a picnic in the forest? Oh, and we ate those flaming tamarind candies from Beardos. That was one of the best days. I know. We all said that afterward. If I give her another flaming tamarind candy, maybe it'll make her remember that day and snap out of this DJ Fireball thing. Worth a shot. Grab me one too? No time to waste. Sorry, Rad. You've changed, KO. I've got to make Enid remember.
Hey, DJ Fireball! I got you a going away gift! Here you go! Thanks. I'll eat it later. No! Uh, eat it now! Uh, okay. Hot and sweet! Listen to me carefully. Your name is not DJ Fireball. It's Enid! I know that! I want you to go back in your memories. To the day you and Rad and me went for a picnic in the forest. We had flame and tamarind candies that day, too. I remember! Hard to believe the plaza is just through those trees over there. Ooh. Is this an enchanted forest? Or just the regular kind? I think it's just the regular kind, K.O. Guys, you know what we should do after an epic picnic like we just had? Campfire! Way to have a good idea for a change, Rad. All right, we need logs. K.O., can you find us three logs for the fire? You got it, Enid! And we'll need some rocks to get a spark going and to build the pit. K.O., can you find us five rocks? You got it, Rad. Hey, wait! What are you guys gonna be doing while I find all that stuff? Using my phone to look up how to start a campfire in the wild? I'm gonna be honest. I'll be just getting a quick post-picnic snooze in. I think I figured out this whole campfire thing. Huh? Oh, right. That. Guys, is it just me, or has this been a great day at the plaza? With you, little buddy. Yeah, it has been. There were no annoying customers at the bodega. I found an energy bar in the parking lot, and there was only one bite taken out of it. And Mr. Gar let me clean the employee washroom again. Oh, I guess uh, maybe I owe you an apology then. Anybody want a flame and tamarind candy from Beardos? Gimme! Hot! Yep, please. missing one thing. <laughs> What's that, Enid? I'm thinking the same thing, sister. <sighs> oh, oh, I could really go for a... <laughs> How rude of you to plan a picnic and not invite us. You can do this, K.O.
perfect plaza day. Yep, they don't come better than this. Bashing box more bots with my buds. KO, great fighting out there. You keep that up and you'll get your POW card in no time. Man, some days I feel like I never want to leave the plaza. Some days? More like every day! Maybe when Gar retires, I'll take over for him and run the bodega. You? As if Gar would choose you as his replacement over me. What if we all run the bodega together? And dedicate our lives to helping people. Battling evil in whatever metallic form it takes. And providing quality heroic products at reasonable prices. <laughs> Deal. Hi, men. We'll change the name to Rad and Co. Who wants to tell Mr. Gar we decided the future of the plaza? Not me. Okay, enough. Enough! I remember. Enid, are you back? Is it you again? Of course it's me, K.O. It was always me. I just got a little lost. I was so worried the whole DJ Fireball thing was going to take you away from us forever. Well, DJ Fireball is going on hiatus. I don't want you to stop making music, Enid. I love your music. I I'm your biggest fan. I just don't get why being really good at something means you have to act really bad to everyone around you. I broke one of my own rules of cool. Thinking you're ultra cool is ultra lame. And acting like a jerk is automatic cool disqualification. Thanks for snapping me out of it, K.O. Okay, now I'm a little confused. How can you be cool if you can't think you're cool? It's simple. Don't think. Be. Ha ah, ha ha! I'm doing it! Wait a second! Iron stats in that fight back in the forest we both remembered. How does that even work? Eh, just go with it. Alrighty! I'm impressed, K.O. 